Mirweneza mwese. so that uh, our debate doesn't uh, later on get to learn what I said through a translation. I will speak in English, so that, uh, the translation is the other way around. Uh, first of all, I'm uh, very glad, uh, I'm absolutely happy that uh, we are witnessing uh, uh, a scheme like this one, uh, which uh, has improved uh, lives of so many uh, to a level uh, many people not have thought could be achieved in such a, a short time. Uh, Howard, I wanted to thank you for not only your friendship with uh, this country of Rwanda and the people and myself, uh, but also for the partnership that has become very productive in this way, uh, where uh, in agriculture and conservation and uh, all that uh, have come together to make a big difference for so many lives. We are told 2,000 people plus who are benefiting from this. Not just benefiting by receiving handouts or anything, but receiving uh, best practice, uh, different inputs from uh, the investments uh, Howard you have made, uh, I, I don't think we can be more thankful. Uh, and, and the work you are doing with our country and the investments you are making uh, seem to be going on and on and on. And uh, we are very happy with that. We are really very grateful for that. And uh, I think the reward for you and for all those who are doing their best to make this uh, partnership uh, as successful as uh, it has been and continues to be, I think is seeing uh, bright and happy faces of thousands of Rwandans uh, saying they are able to learn, to do things, and uh, show uh, the benefits in real life. Uh, benefits in uh, productivity, benefits in revenues, uh, benefits in all matters that matter to uh, people's lives. So I think we, we have also, the Rwandans have uh, a challenge to make sure that uh, this productive uh, relationship never comes to waste uh, at any point. In fact, earlier when we were talking of, uh, uh, well, a good number of people, 10 times, uh, improvement in productivity, others, everyone has, has definitely seen a big change, big improvement from uh, one who was producing uh, half a ton or one ton per hectare of maize, seeing up to five, others close to 10 tons, you can see there is, so we are talking about how do we even continue to take those who are seeing uh, one and a half or two tons to take them to that level. Uh, and we are talking of saying we just need uh, to keep close to these people and advise them and work with them and even show what they are missing, 
uh, that they are capable of achieving, of doing, because the other ones have. Uh, and so if you can take it from three, four, five hectares to close to 10, I mean, uh, tons per hectare, uh, then it is only showing what is possible that everyone can do. And, and that is the spirit that uh, characterizes what we have been doing or want to do. And uh, uh, Howard Buffett Foundation has been very central here in uh, helping us drive uh, this spirit of achieving, of success in the transformation of uh, the lives of Rwandans and the, the country as a whole. So uh, Howard, I can't be more grateful. Uh, we want to continue working with you in whatever you have decided to support us to achieve. The road, you heard about the road that is coming. Uh, you know the meaning of that, uh, over which we are going to partner with the Howard Buffett Foundation. So, and I wanted to thank the many Rwandans, the farmers, but those uh, who have been leading them uh, through these uh, cooperative activities. And Howard, the people you brought, you came with from the United States, who have been so well integrated uh, in the country and with our people, and many others going to do the work at uh, uh, So I think we, we, we can only expect uh, that uh, things will get better and better, and uh, uh, we are very happy about this. So thank you so much. Thank you, everyone. Magnifique, thank you for the leadership uh, in driving these activities. Uh, so we and thank everybody who, who is participating in uh, this scheme that uh, is only demonstrating uh, uh, what we can achieve and how far we can go. So thank you very much.